and the U of A continues to step up to help out in this battle against the coronavirus. News 4 Tucson's David Kelly is on the U of A medical campus right now with what the school is invest inventing now. I said last week there are some research universities that make things happen and there are some research universities that wonder what the hell is happening. U of A continues to be one of those research universities that is making things happen. Last week U of A was producing COVID-19 test kits. Now they're producing PPE. That's right. Personal protective equipment like surgical masks. The seal on these masks because it's got a bumper to it which has like a shock absorber like system. It affects a much better seal than the N95s. Which means this mask will really grip the face. The 95 in N95 means the mask can essentially block 95% of airborne particles. This prototype mask actually performs better than an N95 because the filter on that is actually an N99. So that means the U of A prototype could filter out 99% of airborne particles. We have probably another iteration or so of, of modifications to improve the design, but I'm hoping that we'll be making these things next week for use for application. And once U of A's 3D code is approved by the National Institute for Occupational Safety and Health and the Center for Disease Control, the university expects it'll be able to produce about 1,000 masks per week. Not to mention that single code can be shared for mass production around the world. We've got you covered here at the U of A Medical Campus. I'm David Kelly, News 4 Tucson.